This is the Tuesday's edition of the Boys State News, and uh, tensions are high today. I'll tell you what, we have our two reporters out now. Nick and Jacob are live on the scene interviewing the candidates. Take a look. Hi guys, I'm here with Connor Wickline, the nationalist uh, electee for governor, and we're going to ask him a few questions about the election today. All right, Connor, so your, my first question to you is why did you decide to run for governor? Oh, that's a great question. I've thought about that a lot. Um, my main reason I want to run, um, I, I go back to the, the first clause of the Constitution, for the preamble of the Constitution for the American Legion, which is to uphold and defend the Constitution. I've had many members in my family, most, most all male members in my family have served in the military, all the way back from the Civil War, all the way up to the Persian Gulf War and Project Iraqi Freedom, and they have done that. They have upheld the Constitution and defended it, and it was their right. And I've wanted to follow in their footsteps, and I've never really seen myself as military quality, but I've always wanted to do that in some way. And this is the first real opportunity that I've had to do that, to uphold and defend the Constitution as governor of Boy State. That's very, very interesting and very, very inspiring, I say. Okay, so one more question for you. What is one thing, if you are elected governor, um, that you would like to change or will change? Uh, the, the main thing, I don't, I'm not uh, big on changes right yet. The first thing that I want to do as governor, of course, is elect positions, which is something I have to do. I'm going to keep a clear mind while doing that. I want to elect the people that are best suited for those positions. So that, that, that's the main thing I want to get done as so governor once, first thing. Once again, Connor Wickline, national, gov gov national governor electee. Good luck to you, Connor. Hey, thank you. Thank you. Yep. Hey guys, I'm here with Jacob Chops Pinnell, the Federalist uh, electee for governor, and today we're going to ask him a few questions about the election. Alright, first Chops, um, what made you decide to run for governor here at Blue State? Well, you see, I originally wasn't planning on running for governor when I first found out I'd become the Boy State. I actually originally planned on applying for DNR. Then I started thinking about all the leadership opportunities that I've had and done. I figured this would be a great one to go for at least. I figured anyone would have a good shot at it. Anyone should. And that and also I have members of my family in the military. My cousin served in Iraq. Yeah, I was in Iraq. And I talked to him a lot whenever I was going to plan on getting ready and come here. I uh, put an application for the Samson Scholarship. I talked to him a lot then. So I really feel like I would do a good job. That's the main reason why. All right. Um, so one last question here for you. Um, what's one thing you want to do or will change or would like to do if you are elected governor? If I was elected governor. Specific changes right now. You know, I haven't really, we haven't really talked a lot about what the people of our boys' state want changed yet. Yeah. But I want to... I want to change whatever they want to change to get make things better. Obviously, keep things reasonable, but as long as things are reasonable, I want to improve anything. Man of the people. Yeah. You can put that in there. The man of the people. Man of the people. Gotcha. All right. So once again, we're here with Jacob, Pop, Jacob Chops, uh, Purnell, and I uh, running for the Federalist Party. Good luck, Jacob. Thank you. Today in sports, Kanawa took on Lewis in basketball, Monroe faced Panhandle in sand volleyball, and Calhoun faced Marion in court volleyball. In softball, Webster took on a combination of Barber and Braxton. Randolph and Upshur faced off in ultimate frisbee. Yeah, I'm going to 
Don't overdraw your account. Come check your balance today at the Boys State Bank. My name is Zachary Knott. I'm the Vice President of the Boys State Bank. Come see us to get loans and promissory notes for the auction this Thursday. This is Rolling Polling here. I'm running for Commissioner of Agriculture. I'm a godly man. I'm a family man. I'm here to roll out for you. So vote for Rolling Polling tonight in the general election. Thank you very much.